And so, humanity disregards even against the mechanisms of its own conscience, which God had installed within it in order to know the difference between right and wrong, good and evil. And still humanity abuses them, pushing itself ever further from God and the practical applications of God's instructions for and to it on the mechanisms of the heavens, earth, body, mind, good and evil. And so, Mr. Chambers, you cannot blame God, sir, for your own insurrections or errors, nor can you blame God for your conscious choice to not listen to the very instincts which God had placed within you for you to know the differences between right and wrong. And so on the account of all the accusations which you've made against God, you, sir, are in error. Yet in this, you most certainly cannot see because in truth, humanity does not want a savior. Because whenever it is asked for one, God has provided and placed one among us even in knowing that when upon that Savior arrives to inform humanity and show it how to lift itself from its burdens of heavy laden, it persecutes, crucifies, and destroys them because in all reality it's not a Savior that humanity wants, but a slave who will do it all for them. A slave that will do the things for it which it should be doing for itself and one another. Therefore behold in that wisdom which you, sir, may never fathom is God's plan and the inertia of life and being. Yet even so, you yourself will not listen but rather choose to allow the afflicted and corrupt among you to lead you to your own demise no matter what great things God has laid before you or what solutions of great mystery God has placed at your feet and so it is no wonder that even you Mr. Chambers refuse to see that God loves you more than God loves the self that self who speaks the words I am the one who gave us the Ten Commandments, which you are also, in part, responsible for allowing to be withdrawn from the places they were originally kept, to remind us of the basic respects entitled to both God and humanity itself. And so that's all I have to say on this account. Not holy this holy is double A. Balls and macaroni. Thank this you for listening. For real, he ain't no phony. Step up to the plate and ride the pony. Just sit down and listen to what this dude told me and show me. If you're a real mystic, then listen what I tell you. Hear the great wisdom of this Abalonia father, not some blabbing failure. Yeah, this old dude who picked me up but didn't pass the plate. Let me away from the thugs and drugs and ran my life with their fate and hate. You open the book and I see the light. Just wake up and open your eyes for real or just say goodnight.